Hello guys, welcome back to NoCP Technology. My name is Shripal and today I'm going to demonstrate you how to install Oracle Instant Client on Window and Linux platform. So without wasting your time, let's move on the computer screen and do the practically. But before starting my tutorial, I request to you, if you are new on my channel, please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you can get my all the notification in your mailbox. Using this link, you can download the Oracle Instant Client for Window and also for Linux. Which flavor you are using, you just download the Oracle Instant Client for that uh, compatible. And uh, first of all, I'm going to download the Instant Client for the Windows. Also follow the same steps for the Linux platform and other flavors. We need to download three files. First, basic package. Second, SQL plus package and tools package. I have already downloaded all files. Now we need to unzip all these files inside the C drive or if you want to unzip these files on other location so you can unzip the files on other location. Okay. Uh, after unzip it will be created a folder instant plan 21 which is the default Oracle home directory. Oracle recommend to unzip the file inside the C drive okay it's done now go inside the your computer property just right click on the this computer and select the properties here select the advanced system setting in the advanced system setting click on the environment variables and inside the system variable click on the path and edit add new path here just click on the new button and enter the path here your client software then ok 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 and ok now add the tns name.ora and sqlnet.ora file inside the network and admin folder you can directly copy these files from the production machine here one readme file already available which uh, which is the instructions file which has the clearly mentioned we need to copy tns name.ora and sqlnet.ora file here okay i copied my tns and sqlnet.ora file here and my and my tns file look like this let's try to connect with the database open the cmd prompt and try to log in in the database okay finally I'm able to log in in the database and check the database details for the Linux machine you can follow the same steps and it will be done for you okay if you want separate video for oracle client installation on the linux platform please write in the comment box then i will be upload the same video i hope you found this video informatic if yes please like comment on the video thanks for watching see you in the next video till then take care and bye bye